what is going on guys? It's your film dudes host, your Noah, and today we are going to be making a DIY s'mores casserole. It doesn't take that long to make, might give you a stomach cramp, and it barely requires any ingredients. We've got the chocolate, but I got two packs because I'm extra fancy. We've got the graham crackers, and last but definitely least, we've got the marshmallows. done it definitely does not have to be perfect as you can see and I chose to sprinkle graham cracker crumbs on the top because I thought it makes me look like a pro chef or something so once you finish that make sure to preheat your oven to 350 degrees and then once your oven is preset to 350 degrees you put the casserole in close it up and set a timer for 10 minutes and then you wait Let's see how it is. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. that is satisfaction at its finest. Perfect thumbnail. <laughs> oh, it turned out just how I thought it would. And now for the taste test. So fluffy. <laughs> it's gonna cut out a little spray. Remember to experiment with this. Maybe try to put it in for a little bit longer. No. Ooh, it's fine. That looks pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna wait for it to cool down and then I'm going to serve it on a plate. real way to eat this. That's good. Okay, that is one tasty dessert. Totally worth it. Not very expensive at all. It's super easy to make. I think that's some of the best dessert I've ever had. Mm -hmm. Like and subscribe. Try this at home. I'll leave a set of directions in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video. Enjoy. Here's some more casserole. So, anti-algebra kid, what do you think about the s'mores casserole? It's not algebra! Bro, why did I even ask? 